Okay girls, I'm going to attempt to show you the first way that I did this. And you want to get one color and pretty much take everything off the brush. And then you want to run it across the top of the pattern. Notice how it's only really getting the lines and not going into the pockets of the pattern. Okay, now I am just going to take my other color and put it all over the top of it. So then it fills in the rest. And then you let it dry, and then put a clear coat on it, and let that dry, and then peel it off. Okay, and then, then this is the other way I was doing it, kind of like using it like a stamping plate. And then you gotta be really light to just scrape the top. And then you want to cut your other color. It has to be a different color or it doesn't work. You're not going to get the look you want. <laughs> no, you probably should have waited maybe for that to dry a couple seconds but for the sake of this video and then let that dry top coat it and peel it off okay i peeled them off now and this is how they were facing down on the mat this is what it looks like when you turn it over This one I realized I should have chosen a different color scheme. It's a little trial and error for me also. So let's see how it looks on a nail. Just excuse the camera. Nicked some of it off. Okay, let's see what happens when I put a top coat.
Ta da! Okay, here's the other one. Let's see how it looks. Couldn't find another fake mail at the moment. Let's, let's slap it on this card. Scales are still there. <laughs> 